Hey guys, JT here. As you can probably hear by the voice, um, I'm not feeling too great. So rather than not put out a video this week, I thought I'd hand it over to my AI avatar and let him talk to you for a little while. So over to you, JT. Thanks, JT. I appreciate you letting me take the reins for this one. As someone who recently realized that retirement is only a few years away, I began to think about how having solar and battery storage really set my family up for a secure retirement without having to worry about global energy prices. Are you getting ready to retire or at least starting to think about it? Then let's look at what you can do to prepare to be energy independent. In this video, let's discuss things you should consider as part of your retirement planning that could make a massive difference in your financial stability during those years. It's about making your future more predictable and protecting yourself from unexpected energy cost hikes. On a fixed retirement income, the last thing you need is for your budget to be controlled by global energy markets. For example, when Russia began its illegal invasion of Ukraine, energy prices went through the roof and millions of households saw their bills skyrocket. Today, we are seeing further uncertainty in the Middle East, and it's looking like this will have a knock-on effect with energy pricing, but we can do something to insulate ourselves from this. In early 2022, as Russian tanks poured over the border into Ukraine, we saw major restrictions on gas exports from Russia. This had the knock-on effect of pushing up electricity prices. Friends of mine saw three to 400% rises in their energy bills from just the year before, and were paying upwards of $3,000 a year for electricity. Imagine facing that in retirement when living on a fixed income and every dollar counts. It's a scary thought, but it's real, and it shows why taking control of your energy costs before you retire is essential. To mitigate this, a solar and battery storage solution can provide you with something that is hard to come by these days. Predictable outgoings. Once you have owned a solar system for a few years, it will have paid for itself, and at that point, your energy is effectively free. Add a battery to the mix and you're saving during the day and protecting yourself from high costs during peak energy times in the evening. You can eliminate your utility bills completely with a correctly sized solution and sufficient sunshine. It's all about being in control. Knowing what your bills will be in the future allows you to plan effectively and has the bonus of making sure you don't get any nasty surprises. But here's the thing. If you're considering solar and battery storage, do your homework first and choose a good installer. Ensure the company will be around to provide support in the coming years. If something goes wrong, you will need to call in the experts. And I know it's tempting, but don't get drawn in by the cheapest quote. Remember, this system will last more than 25 years, so make sure you have the backing of a solid company. The industry has seen many companies fold or just abandon their customers. So choose an installer with a solid track record and long-term stability. Remember to check out the manufacturer's warranties. Aim for one that covers as much of your retirement as possible. Ideally, you want to install your system five to seven years before retiring. This way you can recoup costs and enjoy low predictable energy bills backed by a long warranty of at least 20 years or more once you actually retire. Planning for retirement is about preparing for the unexpected. Solar and battery storage can help give you the control and stability you need. So start doing your research and find a reliable installer who will work to help you size a system that will cover your needs. By taking this step to secure your financial future, your retired self will say thank you. If you're working towards becoming energy independent in retirement or have already taken this step, I would love to hear from you. Please leave a comment below and share your experience. That's all from me for now. I'm going to throw it back to the real JT. Well, I hope you found that useful. If you did, and I'm lucky, I'll see you back here real soon for another one.